All right, guys. So welcome back to another episode of Road 96. So I just wanted to say thank you for the support on the first video. Listen, this is one of those games that just came into the scene. And me personally, on a personal level, it just kind of blew me by surprise. I, I, I wasn't expecting this game to be so inviting and so comforting and just so chill. It really is a chill game. It reminds me a lot, and I mentioned this on the first episode of Life is Strange, you know, or games like that. It's, it's just got this aura that just makes you want to, like, grab a coffee, sit back, and just chill. So, today I've got extra large tea, and I got myself, uh, you know, two waters because it's going to be a long one. I think I'm going to be recording for for about maybe hour and a half, two hours, give or take. We'll see where, where this uh, hitchhiking adventure takes us. But thank you guys again for being here. As always, sit back, relax, and just chill. I don't know what's next. That's why I thought we were so close to the end last time. Because we've arrived. But apparently there's still characters we haven't met. And some of these characters, I think we're going to meet again along the way. And for those of you that are new, there is over 130, 40,000 different choices that can occur within this game. Which is astronomical. I know, that's like the new big word that I've been using. Excuse me, okay? Snacks and drinks? Can I help you at all? Hmm. Special 10-year commemoration of the collapse. There's some never-before-seen footage there. Oh, just proof that the government had explosives rigged on the mountain. Really? Okay. So I like this sometimes when you give certain questions or choices, you select certain questions or just dialogue. You don't, that's it. That's what you chose and that's that's that. I like that. Some games make you circle back and select every single one. I'm gonna be a good person for good karma. We're gonna give $3 to the fortune piggy. Know how I can cross. So is this your stand? Thoughts on the election? Know how I can cross. Keep it down, kid. You want to get my wife and I busted? Can we trust you? Of course. Okay. Some kids try to hide in the trucks and get through that way. Of course, there's no guarantee you'll get past security. They got all kinds of security measures. I hope you find your freedom, kid. We'll be rooting for you. <laughs> all right, dude. So we've got food, we've got a drink. I'll take a drink. All right, so it looks like we've got a couple of signs here on the screen now. Are these like different paths that I can take? Snakes and drinks? Can I help you at all? I thought he said snakes and drinks. But he didn't. He said snacks and drinks. Okay, I probably we can pick lock this. You know what? I'm going to be adventurous and I'm going to take this way in. We're going to go this way. Going through the back of the truck or sneaking behind the back of the truck sounds a little bit too dangerous and yet kind of boring. Less adventurous. I mean, it's pretty adventurous, but I don't know. Oh. Whoa. Hold up there, kid. Not unless I let you. Maybe I won't. And why should I? Give me a good reason. I'm not a cop, okay? I want to cross as why. How do I know? The enemy is getting smarter all the time. Fine. You can go. But I don't like your attitude. Well, I don't really like yours either, dude. <laughs> You don't even look like a security guard anyways. By the way, I had a major issue last time on the last episode with copyright. So if this takes a little bit longer than usual, just, just understand that, okay? Any home. Who wants to know? Uh, I just asked you, maybe myself. Someone looking across, I don't, under I don't understand the question. <laughs> maybe I can help with that. The important word being maybe. Hmm. 
So we've got certain things here, certain options. Is that enough? Oof, hold on, I'll be back. I'll be back. Let's let's interact with all the characters here and see uh, what we can find out. Yeah, but I don't have enough money. Finding your freedom can be expensive. Maybe I should just give up anyway. Maybe you're right. I just need to find a few bucks. Thank you. Listen, man, I appreciate it, but I don't know if I if I can afford to give you an extra ten dollars. Not not right now, because I might have to pay that lady up front 50, 50, 50 bucks to be able to pass myself. Hey there. Want some advice? Uh sure. Uh, don't try crossing over the mountain. I saw a guy from, from the peak one time. He screamed all the way down. And it's a long way down. Just don't go up there. Why do I feel like I want to go up there? Hmm. I was just thinking about that right now. Don't tell anybody, but I've got a guff pass. News like that gets out, and teams will be swarming me. Wait, he's got a guff pass. That's what that lady needs, right? Isn't that what she needs? You see? Could that be a guff pass? Hmm. All right, let me search these little campsites here and see if we can find anything just hanging about. And I love this scenery. The campsite with the birds chirping. Hey, see that door back there? Gotta love it. What does it go to? Yeah, I've tried. Some kids say it leads to an abandoned tunnel. It's rumored you can cross by using it. But maybe it's just a trap. Something Tyrak uses to lure teens to their death. Mm, if the shoe fits. <laughs> if the shoe fits. Okay. So maybe we should question this kid about it. No? You don't want to talk? Four store open. Wow, take it easy. You're not gonna open that door. Not without my help. Oh, is that so? I've been watching officials on this path for some time. Just so happens one dropped their access card the other day. Made this huge magnet, see? But that's not important. My point is, the card's yours for a price. Two reasons claustrophobia and cleaphophobia. Oh, well, fear of being trapped on the ground. Ah, oh, dude, this is sketchy as heck, man. Oh my god, should we go? Oh, that sounds exciting. Good luck down there. I heard it's just a dead end anyway. You just tell you told me that after I bought the card, asshole. Okay, hold on. Let's see if this is by any chance the card that I that I need. Maybe I can tell this guy to come with me. No. Okay, I think this was a bad bad idea. This was probably a bad idea. Oh well. We did it already. Might as well go. Oh my goodness. The bad thing is you have uh, you do have consequences. Good things too. So <laughs> I think I made the wrong choice. I I had a perfect lock pick and I could have lock picked myself into the back of one of the trucks back there. And I decided to go in in here. An underground tunnel where I can't go any I mean I can't go back anymore. I'm sorry. I'm just kind of brain farting all, all over the place here but you know what it's okay i feel like this is probably the most adventurous path out of all of them taking a secret underground tunnel slash passageway april 14th of 1996 in accordance with the recent rulings the old tunnels will be closed and entrances demolished well 
tank. No way. Oh, this is... Cr I like this, dude. We can take the creepy way in. Oh, my God. Let's go, man. This is getting really freaking interesting. Okay, so that's the tunnel. We can pick the lock. What do we have here? I'm gonna keep this. Crackers. Oh, this is so freaking cool. I'm already loving this episode. September 10th, 1986. Important. All explosives and storage should be disposed of rapidly. Orders from the big man. Now, who's the big man, you say? I've got no idea. How do I access my, um... How do I access my, um... Oh, here we go. My snacks. I forgot how to access the snacks. Gotta be honest. Doesn't matter. Let's go. Ooh, this is really creepy. It's okay. Hello, sir. Are you okay? Have you gone crazy? Are you mentally stable? I thought you were a guard. Please, don't shine that at me. My wife and I came down here to cross. These are our boys. She went off to look for a way out when we got stuck. At one point, we heard gunshots. She never came back. Oh, God. I'm sorry. I don't know what we're gonna do. And our food is almost out. Mm. Thank you. I'll give him a snack. Why not? Listen, I'm a sucker for good deeds, okay? You're lucky. You're lucky I'm one of the good guys. If not, I, I probably would have killed you. All right, so these are the two kids looking for the mom. The abandoned underground tunnel. So this is B. Is there a letter there? No. Good luck to you. Well, you ought to just come with me instead of just staying there. Maybe we could find your wife together, but hey. Oh my god, are you kidding me, dude? No freaking way. Oh my god. Okay, so I actually didn't want to come this way. I really didn't. God freedom nothing is more important but there are many others in Petra still looking for it eighty seven days later election day what in the world? Did we just and their journeys have only just begun. Did we just finish the game? Oh, that was episode one.
Wow, I didn't know we had episodes, dude. Whoa. Hello, Sonia Sanchez here. Welcome to the Sonia Show. <laughs> As many of you know, the brigades have a secret mobile radio station which they use to spread their fake news. Well, for years, the person transporting the station has evaded capture. But viewers, I've learned the authorities are closing in and now believe the station is being moved by a truck driver. We remind you there's a $2,000 reward for any valuable information. Come on, people. Let's bring this criminal to justice. Well, you may have heard the rumors that a teen fled our country using abandoned tunnels running <laughs> under the wall. The story is false. I was told this by no other than our great leader himself. No tunnels like this exist, said Tyrak. He even joked that if they did, he'd use them to avoid the traffic jams <laughs> at the border. <laughs> now let's take a moment to look at the latest candidate polls. Looks like Tyrak is still the preferred candidate. Surprisingly, it does appear Flores has some supporters, probably members of the brigades. As you know, the Sonia show is very concerned about our youth who continue to mysteriously disappear. Let's view today's missing teen report. Remember, if you have any information, please call the Sonia hotline. What is this? Missing for 16 days. The 16... hotline is available 24 hours, seven days a week. Let's bring these teens back home. And that has been the Sonia Show. Wait. Wait. What? What in the world? Oh, so you don't get attached to one particular person as multiple stories being told. Oh, that's pretty cool. That's pretty freaking cool. All right, would you look at this? Oh, shit. <laughs> sucks ass i'm just kidding you know i don't mean to be a bad person i was it's only kidding oh about to tear the club up wants to party sonia party oh jesus oh. the third person look all adam's saying is you shouldn't go in this weirdo could be here hey isn't it past your bedtime burn this is a party for important people only, honey buns. Which is why Adam can't go in. Oh, she burned you there. Now, I'm going in. Oh, and the kid is coming with me. What? Nice. He's my date. Come on, kid. What the fuck? Damn. All right, Sonia. Oh, uh -uh, Broseph. Like Sonia said, you gotta be famous. Sonia. It's not Sonia. It's Sonia. Kid, keep an eye Sonia. on her for me. There's a psycho after her. Cause I got worried about. Hmm. Maybe there is, but you can't live your life in fear. Ah, that's a motto of mine. So you're right about fear. As a principal, I live in fear. You sound different. Why? Because on the news, I talk like this. When in reality, <laughs> I talk like this. GNN thinks I sound smarter without the accent. Oh. Yes, if you ask me. <laughs> Somebody told me in the comments, uh, GNN <laughs> stands for Ghetto News Network. Shoot. Okay, so know anything about the cops on Rule 96? Do you do stories on Teens Crossing? 
Any tips for surviving on the road? Teens trying to cross is our bread and butter at GNN. I've even heard about kids crossing via Mount National. Can you imagine? Teens uh, will stay in if it floors winds. You should try objective reporting on national. Get out of here. Hmm. Objective journalism don't get many views, sweetie. Now go on and enjoy yourself, sugar. Okay, okay. That's adorable. <laughs> this is freaking hilarious. Okay, so. It looks like we're definitely gonna meet a ton of people along the way, which is what are you doing here? Which is gonna be yeah, pretty interesting. And this is where we were, right? We were up here with her. Okay, so we came all the way down. I'm gonna check every single play pos uh, place possible here. Hmm. Seems like they're throwing the floor as uh poster cards in the toilets this looks like a very uh, heavy uh, republican party s scene here get a scratch ticket i've only got 17 dollars so what happens if i get a scratch uh scratch ticket hmm the petra official government official scratch of course i would freaking lose i never won anything it doesn't even matter why do I even try? What is this? Do you want to play a game? What's up, dude? Yeah, why not? If you win three Tyrek badges, you get a prize. You earn one badge for each game that you win. There's a game here to my right. Step into the cage. The goal is to knock the cans down. The other games and the arcade. Oh god. Oh god, this is dumb. I have no money to be doing this crap. How'd I do? Oh, come on. Jesus. Okay, item acquired. Tyrek vote ba uh, voter badge. Someone in the party is willing to exchange them. You win. Keep going. The other games and the arcade. Okay, so maybe that's gonna be useful to get into some sort of party or a party of people. Nah, I don't feel like dancing. I don't feel comfortable. So, what do we have here? This is a strange party. Any tips for the road? What do you mean? Who are all these people? The people here are weird. Weird? <laughs> I don't know. Generous? Definitely. <clears throat> They're all big donors to Tyrak's campaign. He's throwing a big party for all of them ahead of his next election. Tyrak, what a great guy. Well, I'm sorry, sweetheart, but I don't have enough money to buy food. So, you know, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a teenager and I'm kind of broke right now. I'm actually not that hungry, thankfully, but eventually I will be. An ATM. That's a, we don't we don't have an ATM account. What are you what, what are you, you talking want, about? Kid? Oh hi. <laughs> Nothing. I just wanted to be friends. That's all. Okay, it looks like we've got another mini game here. Let's go check this out. All right, we can't access the uh, back part, right? No. Tape. What is that? Oh, those are three bucks. Nice. Play. No. Okay, fine, fine. We've got this. It's okay. Easy peasy. Do we get money for this, by the way? Excellent. Let's go. <laughs> yes. Okay, one more.
Oh, we done. No? Nice. So, the voter badge. Another one. Interesting. Maybe we've got to win all three, um... Maybe we've got to win all three minigames. Play air hockey. Okay. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, this is not very practical. <laughs> oh, my God. Let's go, nerd. <laughs> Holy crap. Bro. I am the air hockey master. No, I'm not. I was only kidding. Oh, God. Okay, that's it. I got three, right? We're good? Okay. We've got another badge. Well, that one was a little bit nerve-wracking. You see, that's why you're here all by yourself, because you're a loser. Okay, so maybe now that we've got the badges, we're able to go inside. Let me go to this one. You got levers under the table. I know you do. Hi, kid. Perhaps you'd like to play. Honey buds. Nice to see you. This round is free, young man. Okay. Focus on the ball. Ready? Here we go. Duh. And you win. See? It's simple. You shuffle faster for me. Another try, young man? <laughs> I see what and he's doing. A bet too. I see what he's doing. Okay, let's do it. Here we go. Excellent. If you win, you get double. A wise bet. You don't take your eyes off the cup. Ready? Here we go. Here we go. Easy, bro. Excellent pick, young man. Excellent pick, young man. Another round. <laughs> I'm gonna get in on this. Put a little bet down in my own. The lady has spoken. Oh, shut the hell up. <laughs> Shoot, I left my wallet near the can. Get it for me, honey buns. Near the can. Where? Near the cans. Wait, what? Near the toilets, I said. Run! Hey, hey, hey. I'm gonna need to calm down there, sweetheart. Oh, where the hell are the toilets? I should have told I'm not a servant, to be honest. What? Wait, why would you leave your... Why would you leave your wallet there? This man is... Oh, steal? No, I'm not gonna steal. I'm gonna be a good person, okay? Lucky devil, you! <laughs> wow, are you kidding? Oh my god. Oh my god. What guy? So, like I said, I'm gonna put more dough down on the kid. Ready? Here we go. There we go. That was a serial killer, probably. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Calm down there. Okay, that was right. Easy peasy. Let's go. 30 bucks, dude. I'm gonna put down some more. Jelly bean here is a goddamn winner. I know it. Yes, a real winner. Look who's starting to sweat, sweet cheeks. Clown face here. Ready? Let's go. Here gonna make go. dough right here, boys. Let's go. What the fuck? You, you win. Oh, dude, what a come up. Uh-oh. Looks like Cutie Pie has your number. Let me put down even more. Ready? Oh, God. Here we go. What the fuck was that? Oh, no. How unfortunate. Shut your mouth. Good. Give me a second. I'll be right back. You better. Honey Buns and I ain't done yet. 
bro, how was I even supposed to do? <laughs> what the freaking hell? Oh Jesus, not again! I'm a little freaked, Sonia. Worry about taking a shower. I'm fine. Uh. Ever seen a weird guy before? You need to leave now. Honey, throw a rock and you'll hit one of my stalkers. You could be a stalker. <laughs> what Wait, the fuck? Are you a stalker? Now that's exactly what a stalker would say. You know what? Get me a drink from the tent. Get one for yourself, too. You need to chill. Honey bun. I know you <laughs> You see these hands? They can tear a man in two. Now I know. I know jujitsu. <laughs> okay. Um, where do you want me to go get you some drinks? When I get back, she's not even gonna be here anymore. I know it for a fact. She's gonna be done. Uh, gone. She's gonna be gone. She's gonna be gone. And gone and possibly dead. Okay. Where do I go get her the drinks? Oh, and by the way, I gotta be careful for, for myself, you know, my own sanity. I'm, I might die. Oh, look at him right there. Hey, you're with Sonya, right? Yeah, that's right. Well, um, some weird guy in a hat was just talking about her. Bro. I'm not sure. There was a lot of um grunting, but he didn't like her. I know that much. What do you mean? They're all big donors to Tyrak's campaign. He's throwing a big party for all okay, the where, of where, his Okay, where where do I go get the Tyrak, drink? Tyrak, what a great guy. Okay, should I go back to her? I, I'm, I'm, I'm getting a little worried. Sorry, kid. This is private. Okay, fine, fine. So you're telling me this is where the the poor people hang out? Okay, fine. All right. Where? Where'd she go? I freaking knew something was gonna happen. I don't know, kid. I thought she was with you. I really hope something bad didn't happen to her. What if this guy's the killer secretly? What if he's got some sort of stunt double? Missing teens. Do you have any information? Call. Oh, this is getting creepy. Sonia! Sonia! I'm a little scared. Uh, I think. I think. Have you seen Sonia? Reward a thousand uh, dollars if any information regarding the the transmitter. Okay. I have not. Sorry. Okay, hold on. Uh, where's the bar? Are there any games to play? Where are the toilets? Have you seen Sonia? Sorry, I have not. But what a wonderful journalist she is. Tyrax's favorite, you know. Is that so? You'll find all refreshments at the big tent. Tyrax loves to refresh his citizens. Let me see if this chick has seen her. No, she just wants to dance. Got a scratch ticket. Let's go. <laughs> 20 bucks. Hey, dude, what the hell's going on here? Let me go back this way. Sonia! Damn it, where are you, woman? This is not a joke. Talk to the driver, kid. Calm down, kid. She's in the limo. Wait, what? Maybe. But we'll never find him or her now. Besides, Sonya's tired. Okay, so I'll, I'll go home with her. But thanks for looking after her. No. You know she's Sonya. 
But she's a good person underneath. She's not in there, dude. I, I need proof. I need, I need proof, damn it. I'm sure that uh, she is. Wait, are you in love? <laughs> I don't know about all that. <laughs> in love with Sonya? <laughs> don't be ridiculous. That's our secret, okay? <laughs> it totally Keep is. Around, kid. I don't believe him. I don't believe him. What if... What if he's the the weird creep? Hmm. Okay, so here we go. We can steal a car. I don't I don't got the keys. What's going on here? We can call for a cab. What is this? We can rest here. Interesting. Leave and walk along the road. Let's hitchhike. Let's see if we find someone to hitchhike with. <laughs> oh my god. So we're going from 1,861 miles to what exactly? What the heck happened to Sonya? So oh, dude, the music in this game is fantastic. And look who it is, this chick. I like how you have different characters that you're playing with. You're playing different perspectives, but you're still kind of knowing what happens to all the characters in the game. Like this chick right here. We get to see what, what her journey's like. She left the camp, which we met her in the camp. And this is what's going on with her. Remember, she said she wanted to go by herself. Hmm. Okay. Sweet Jesus. Given all the hostility, it's normal the police would get violent. Wait, you're saying the police are justified in using violence? There's music in this game for I'm sure. Now I'm not the only one subjected to this. There's literal music in this game that will get me copyrighted. Dude, what the hell am I doing? Bro, I'm crazy. How can I be? Where's where's even the freaking? There's no option to even take out the music. Oh, there it is. Never mind. I am a fool. If if this video gets claimed as well, then I'm just gonna take off the music. Um, we'll see what happens. Well, hello there, cutie. Uh, thanks for the ride. Uh, that bad, huh? Uh, thanks People for the ride. People are looting, Jeff. What good will come of that? Looting is reasonable when the system is so broken. Do you Very think they true. Always talk like this. Uh, I hope not. I kind of like it. Is there, uh, it's their foreplay? Gross, dude. <laughs> I'm a little kinky, uh, after hours. I'm sorry. Can I? So, you're one of us, aren't you? Ooh, the drink here. Thank you very much, one of us. You're trying to cross the border, like me. I can smell it on you, literally. Ooh. So it looks Let's like, talk about uh, something else, then. It looks like Zoe didn't like our first Think character. Know what we're really up to? But I think she's digging this one. Uh. Yeah, they seem kind of with it for adults. What the, what the so, hell? I got an idea. Ooh. Okay. Let's play this game I found and listen to some music. Oh god, Here, no music, Zo Walkman. Zoe. Zoe, no, I'm gonna get a copyright Wait, strike. Have you played before? I like to know my opponent's strength before crushing them. So let me try. So I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. Let me try something. If I take out this music. Oh, you see, it's not as fun, dude. It's boring. It's boring without the music. 69. <laughs> uh, I lost my grandma once. I'm an average player. Sorry, I'm kind of amazing. <laughs> A challenge. I like that. Oh, what are we doing here? Oh, oh, is this what connect five or something? 
Sorry, I, I don't really play this. I actually play this with my five-year-old son and he kicked my ass. Oh, it's Connect 4! Oh my god! Want a rematch? Yes, wait, I'm so trash. Let's do this. Yes, absolutely. No, what? Not happening. Sorry. Sorry, not happening. Oh, she blocked me. What a stud. Um. Okay, um, what the heck? Okay, she's actually really freaking good. Borderline, not even fair. And that's the win. Wow, I'm so oh, trash. Do you like the music? Uh, Don't yes. Don't worry about hurting my feelings. I'm a big girl. Uh, yeah, it's fantastic. Too bad I really suck at Connect 4. God, I'm atrocious. I've got all kinds of tapes. Here, so you remember me. Revolution 96. Oh, look at this. Did we get any luck? No, absolutely not. I got $100 in my pocket. Zoe, you want to go on a date? I am totally up for it. So, do you want to cross? When do you leave home? When did you leave home? What do you want to cross? To start a new life. Oh, you're going to start no, it with me, girl? Come on now. have a life. Oh. My dad thinks I'm lucky to have a big house and go to a prep school, but I'm not. Believe me. Listen, you need to stop worrying about the wrong thing, sweetheart. You are lucky indeed. You, you've got no idea what you're talking about. Well, it is. Look, I'm going to tell you something, okay? Maybe I shouldn't, but I feel like I can trust you. My father is the minister of oil. Keep it down. Did you kids say something? Uh, just that you have a great ban? Thanks. Oh, I feel better now that I've told someone. I wanted to tell this one kid, but we got kicked out of our campground before I could. Uh, Talking about the last one. Thinking of me like you did before? As this exquisite being you're lucky to share oxygen with? I can definitely try. I, I didn't think that. Just kidding. <laughs> hey, kids. Uh-oh. Good luck. Can I ask you something? Uh, you're kind of creepy, dude. Seriously? I was wondering, would you say you're political? Uh, no. Dude, don't really. get don't get into that with me, dude. What about you? No. No. But you're leaving because Petria has problems. Well, yeah, but let's Please not don't deny you are. Let's let's not get into that, dude. Seriously, that's an understatement. <laughs> Jeff, <laughs> an undercover agent. What? I could be an undercover agent. Anyway, because you are leaving, you two are political, at least according to me. Oh, okay, cool. So since you are Jeff, almost done. Oh, he's going to kick us off. What do you do to change this place? Uh, vote for a new president. Uh, not sure what can be done. Honestly, is our vote really gonna matter? Let's just put vote for a new president. It could work. I'm not sure. The system might be broken. What's certain is that it's the youth who are going to make change happen. If it happens at all. Finally, we agree on something. You know what's funny? When I was in school, and I was, t I was speaking to Rebecca about this. When I was in school, the teacher would always tell us, you guys are the future. It's the youth that matters. It's the youth that's going to fix this country. The country's never been so fucked up in my life. Or in life, period, honestly. This country is in shambles. <laughs> Borderline shambles. We will change the country. I don't see anything changing. To be honest. Let's not get political here, okay? I'm sorry to hear you say that. Oh no, road control. You go over the speed limit? No, I mean, I don't think so. Oh, great. Oh, that's just great. We got pulled over by the popo. Hmm. Everyone stay calm. Kids, let us do the talking.
Road control, ma'am. License and registration. <sighs> Happy to help however we can, sir. Sir? He's nothing but a road control zombie. Those are your kids? No, sir. Just giving them a ride. Uh -oh. I see. Oh, God. He's coming over, dude. Oh, what the hell? How are you, officer? Are you all right, son? You seem a little nervous. I'm perfectly fine. Hey, you look like one of the kids on the missing posters. Missing? I have my papers here. Well, just to be sure, I'll need to see your papers. Oh, God. What if we were to make a donation to road control, sir? A donation? Well, for a donation, I suppose I could look the other way. Thank you, officer. Wait, wait, you're not really going to pay this guy, are you? It's people like you that are ruining this country. Excuse me? Be quiet. Oh, God. This was a bad idea. Zoe, you changed my mind. Jesus Christ. Oh, come on. This turd in a uniform isn't going to do anything. That's it. You're coming with me. What have you done, Zoe? Ah, don't touch me, What pig. do we do? I don't know. I don't know. Ah, ah, uh. Stay in the car, boy. Do what he says. Oh, that's right. What? I warned you, didn't I? Lucky it's not you I'm interested in. No! Wow. Well, that went freaking sideways. Thank you very much. <laughs> what just happened? Wow, dude. Unbelievable. Walking in my shoes. Well, that was a waste of Can you hear me? Life. What's that noise? It's a bug messing with the connection but don't worry prepubescent einstein here is gonna fix it oh look who it is help me a sec homie i got a bug i need oh, to fix this guy home girl this is mr home girl yo we live in a quid pro quo society what happened to altruism for the sake of altruism but yeah fine i'll give you a little something something don't sweat it, Mr. Yu. It's just a hitchhiker. Mr. Ursus. He's a friend of mine. Take this computer. I put a metal detector on it. Check the ground near the pole over there. Should be some hidden keys to open the box and reboot the line. Petra Calm hides their keys like a dog hides a bone. Whoa. Rusty can. Oh, damn, got some money. Bro, this guy's genius. Look at all the freaking gadgets this kid's made. Talk to me, dog. Dog. I got the keys, dog. Nice oh, boy. Thing, dog. Thanks, dog. You hear me now? I do, yeah. So, as I was going to say. The fake emitters are all in place. Should keep those pigs busy for a while. Thanks, Alex. I put up some fake radio emitters to help the brigades.
The supposed terrorist group who caused the attack in 86. I gotta run, Alex. Wait, wait, my parents! Sorry, kid. Now's not the time. We'll talk soon, okay? Promise. Don't hang up! Home slice. Press the button again. <laughs> Home slice. Are you there? Too late. He's gone. This guy's got a sad life, man. I, I like this character. This little boy. Oh, man. Come on, bud. Don't be sad. I know life sucks sometimes. I'm fine. Just a little frustrated. You're a little fugly too, huh? I'm looking for info on my bio parents. Poor kid. They died when I was young. In the attack in 86. But I haven't come up with much. Thanks. My mom, I mean my adoptive mom, said I might not find out anything. But I didn't believe her. Where's your adoptive mom? She knows you're on the road. Yeah, she does. But that's really all she knows. Hmm. Come on. Let's wait out the rain in the booth. Oh, I don't want to see you sad, bud. Come on. Oh, there's something in the trash, too. I was like... Either money or... Want to hug it out, bro? I... I don't know. Yeah. Well, I guess you're right. Precinct 22. Officer Fanny. Hello? Alex? Is that oh, you? Oh, okay. Yeah. It's me. Is everything okay? What do I say? Everything's fine. I just wanted to check in. Are you getting enough to eat? You are, right? And you can come back whenever you want. You know that. I know, but I still have work to do. I, I hope you find what you're looking for. I miss you, Alex. I, I miss you too. Look, I should go. Oh, already? I'll call again soon. I promise. I love you. Bye. Bye, baby. Well, he's got a good support, Come on. I guess. It's cramped in here. I feel better now. Thanks for encouraging me to call. Oh, that's to throw the trash to good deeds. I don't want to escape myself, but I know a guy who knows a guy who knows a girl who crossed using some secret tunnels at the border. Hmm. Whatever it makes, uh, it takes to make change happen. Floors will destroy the walls. Good ones. I'm gonna be honest with you. Personal hygiene is very important. <laughs> I still have a few things to clean up around here. By the way, there's a cereal bar in my bag if you want. You look hungry. Oh, and I can call you a taxi too. I hacked into Happy Taxi, because I can, and got some free ride vouchers. Uh, taxi or the bus? Yeah. It's as good as done. Thanks, Good Alex. Good luck on your journey, man. Hope you reach 96. 
I like how I like the layout of this game. You're playing as different people, but you, you're developing the story of all the characters you come across. Really cool. And you see it in the menu, like the you have all the like seven or eight characters that we've met, and then you have like a progress within their name that shows you the progress. Wow, incredible. That taxi didn't take me anywhere. Jesus. You see right there at the bottom right? Zoe is 51%. John is 18. Fanny 20, etc. etc. Very interesting. I probably shouldn't have taken the taxi. But maybe now this. Oh god. Are you a dino person? Dude, that's a freaking killer! Ah! Before we get much further, I should let you know that I have some anger management issues. Now you know. So, where are we headed today with Happy Taxi? Then just north it is. We sell scratch tickets if you're feeling lucky. Good luck. <laughs> I won. Let's go. Sorry, dude. I'm stealing from you, but that's okay. Um, so I feel a little bit uneasy with you here driving me. It's going straight north, I've got to say. Um, now sit back and enjoy your ride with Happy Taxi. Let's see who's contacting me now. They're selling your show. How did they get this number? Oh my god. <laughs> Just a second. Oh my god. Damn. Piece of no good, son of a. Yeah, this guy, the, this guy's a little crazy. I like how this says quiet, please. I'm feeling much better now. Yeah, he's going crazy. He's going Go out. on and ask me a question if you want to. I know all kinds of things. Is that so? Take uh, many teams to the border. Know anything about karma? Any thoughts on the cops? I saw you looking at my mags. Are you a fan of dinosaurs? Oh, personally, I, I am. Get angry if you aren't. Oh, I love. Good. Speaking of dinos, have you seen this movie that came out? Gigantic Park. <laughs> Hmm. I don't know if I believe you. Hey. Lean forward. I want to show you something. No. That's a portable VCR. Now I can watch mm. tapes whenever I want. Ooh. When GP comes out on VHS in Petria, I'll watch it every day. It's a very nice VCR. Okay. My daughter would have loved Gigantic Park. Maybe this guy's not as bad as we think he is. But she passed away. Oh, an 86? Lola. But I'll make it right. Huh. And in the meantime, I won't think about that terrible thing that happened to her. I'd become very angry if I did. No. You should take a snooze. You're a teen and your brain is still developing. Very interesting. 
I don't know, man. This guy's gonna... This guy's gonna freaking take me somewhere. <laughs> Where's this guy gonna take us? guy taking us God. Oh God, oh God. Sorry about that. I don't want to play Lola. I don't want it to catch me. I heard a noise earlier, like screaming. I probably should have played Lola. What was that? I just, I, I don't want to piss this guy off. You're not lying, are you? The VCR is warm. You watched one of my cassettes. Which cassette did you watch? One is very private to me. You see? Oh. Oh, thank God. That'll explain the screaming all right. It's pretty hardcore. We've almost reached your destination. I hope you'll consider riding with Happy Taxi again. Cleverness acquired. Hmm, interesting. Dude, I'm supposed to go. Okay, we're going north. North. 18 miles to the border. Almost there. I really like this, dude. Every single character is developing so nicely. My boy, you may want to relax. <laughs> okay, so we found a nice little. Motel, if you will. We're gonna stay in here and too young to die. This doesn't sound too friendly or inviting, to be honest. We're probably gonna die here. No, I'd like you to get a listen to me. What you did is unforgivable. Oh, it's Don't truck driver. You calm down. You're putting a kid in danger. Of course, he said yes. He thinks this is all a game. So, dear Marilyn, I hate being used by Brigade Scum. As a patriot, I want to call the hotline. That's my duty. But I fear that they will, what they will do to me, or do to you, or to our sweet Ruta Bega, if I do. Oh, how I wish I was strong. I was a stronger man. How I wish I was like Tyrek, sincerely, Randall. Oh God. Sorry, dude. What's the code, though? Hmm. What's the code here? I'm gonna leave this closed. Uh, 
I swear to God, if you say that one more time... Listen to me now. Leave Alex alone. Don't know his name. Listen to like me him. now. Leave Alex alone. Alex, is he talking about Alex? Are you for real? Go away, young bud. No, you listen to me. What you did is unforgivable. Are you for real? What do you want, kid? If you want food, sorry. Only truckers can eat here. Oh, wow. Okay, well, now I'm glad I kind of robbed your ass. That's Big John. I heard things about him. Shady things. Okay, let's see if we can find the, uh... Kid, who do you think you're talking to here? A <laughs> What you're talking about is illegal. Now get out. Steal the key. I don't want to steal the key. He's looking. Hmm. Buy a tape. We got to see if we find a Are Cody or somewhere. My guy, will you stop saying that? Listen to me, Robert. You asked a kid to make you a bomb. Are you stupid? If anything it happens is Alex. to him, I'm coming for you. Got me? It is Alex then. Kid, it's me. Can we talk? No, no. Listen, please. You don't want to do that. I know what I promised you, but you can't do that. Oh shit, the stores please. are connecting. Listen. Hello? Hello? The stores are connecting. Oh god damn it! So Jesus, so could it be Mr. You that what told him? Hmm. Well, he was a lot nicer with the other guy. So, dude, you got some change to spare? We go inside here. No. About inside the booth. Inside this car. Jesus. Okay, Young well, bud, that's close. Come over here. Sit down. Listen, sorry I yelled at you earlier. I was just I oh. angry at myself. Anyway, I feel better now that I've eaten a little something. <laughs> I don't want to get into that if you don't mind, but maybe we can chat about something else. Don't got the dough, don't got the choice. It's safe most of the time. Just don't do it often. Sure can feel that way. Hey, I got all this food. Eat something. Thank you. Hey, feeling better? Still look like you've run a marathon in the desert. Ah, feels delicious. Thank you. I got guy. an idea. Why don't you catch up on some Z's in my rig? Well, you don't really. But you can. You have my word. Wait, dude. I wanted to go and freaking get the code. Ah, I don't know what the code was. I feel like I missed a letter or something. And I got a key. A key for what? A car. That's right, the car. Hey, it's time to wake up, young blood. Sorry All to wake right, you up. Like big this. guy. Uh, how'd you sleep? <laughs> Look at this guy's pictures. That's Robert. He's the guy I was angry with on the phone. Ah. I once considered him a friend. Okay. Cool. And who's this? That's the kid I was talking to. He's crazy smart, young boy. You see? Alex, I know that kid, dude. Trust me, I've met him before. It's a small world out here, Big John. Glasses and a tiny computer? 
small world we live in. <laughs> yes, it is. God, I love the music he in this I game. I broke a promise, and I did, but I have my reasons. Yeah, did you break it? What was the promise? Uh, I promised to tell him about his biological parents. Wow. They were in the brigades, like me. Listen, I hate to ask this, but I need your help. I'd like Thanks, to help. Kid. The kid won't listen to me, but maybe he'd listen if you gave him a call on the CB. Okay, I guess I can try. What do I say? Thank you, young blood. I guess I can try. No problem, the Big CB John. Is in front of you. Okay, in front of me, uh, use a CB radio. What's up, Alex? You remember me? I told you, John. I don't want to talk. Uh, it isn't John. Who is this? It's me, dude. You know, the guy that uh, helped you out in the phone and you gave me a ride with the taxi hack you so call or whatever. Uh, I come in peace. I'm a friend of John's. I can help you pick, uh, I helped you fix the payphone. Someone who knows John. I remember. Fix the payphone. Yeah, that was cool, homie. <laughs> I see John's ID on the CV. He there? Oh, me, he ain't this guy. Man, I knew it. Homie, I don't want to be rude, but why are we talking? Homie. <laughs> I see. He told you what I was doing for Robert then? Look, I don't see where this discussion is going. I'm about to hang up. Please, don't lose him, young blood. I don't know, but keep him talking. Well, even if he is, I'm using him too, to get info on my parents. And sometimes, people need to be hurt for a cause. Damn, that was dark. You know what Tyrax's doing to teens, homie. Yeah. One day I'm going to start my own company, yo. Look, I don't got much time. I promise Robert results. Don't do it, kid. You don't want blood on your hands. Believe me, I know. I just want info on my parents. No one will tell me anything. Start. Naomi and Steven. Those were your parents' names. Naomi and Steven? Wow. What you did? That hurt me, John. We had a deal. I trusted you. No, I know. I'm sorry, kid. Please forgive me. I want to know more, but not like this. Can we meet soon? And you'll tell me everything you know? Yeah, yeah, I promise, kid. I... I'll tell him I want out. I just want to make games anyway. <laughs> I don't think he's going to be happy. Oh, what if Robert goes after him afterwards? Let me worry about Robert, kid. Okay. I'll see you soon, okay? Okay. Bye, John. See you soon, kid. Nice. Alex will now build the bomb for the... Yes. Thank you, young blood. Yes. He's safe now, thanks to you. Yes. Excellent. Oh, this dude just left me. He didn't even give me a ride. Hmm. Let me see if I can find a code here somewhere.
Hack. I'm not a hacker, dude. My name is not Alex, you understand? I'm trying to see if there's some sort of numerical sign somewhere here. Maybe I can speak to this dude. This guy looks a little crazy. Truckers only. 12.04. What about... Zero two zero zero seven zero two. About nineteen ninety six. Zero seven zero two. Hmm. What's the freaking code? Hmm. Are you sure it's not 1996? That would be too easy. <laughs> that would be way too easy. Let me see if I close the door. Oh, no. He's in there. Rudy's in there. What? Alright, honestly, I can't find the code. I've pretty much looked everywhere. I just, I would hate to leave like this. about in the phone booth is there some sort of document or something no i know i missed it i missed it in probably the stupidest way ah all right you know what hold on let me check this out all right whatever open up the whip like what up gangsta Let's go. Screw it. Taking our way back to the border. And we're getting the hell out of here. Now, we got to remember Zoe. I think she went to prison or jail. She got caught, unfortunately, but... It is what it is. Oh, God. The wild boys. Get in, Mitch. <laughs> You drive. What the freaking crap? Don't look at us. Okay. Uh, what do you guys want? What do you guys want? Who are you guys? Please don't hurt me. What do you guys want? Just do what we say. And you Watch it. Just do what we say, and you won't get hurt. Okay, fine. Bro, will you please take that shotgun out of my face? Shut up and step on the gas. I'm gonna get stopped by the popo. Oh, not starting outside the laundromat after we rob it, humiliated. Uh, you think I don't know that, Stan? It's your fault, you know. My fault? Oh, that's rich, Mitch. You know what, Mitch? Maybe you should find another Robin partner. Well, uh, maybe I should. Like this kid. Oh, God. Fine. Take the kid. He's clearly a criminal anyway. I'm not, dude. I'm 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 totally a good person. Hold on, hold on. Before we end the best Robin duo ever, let's take a deep breath. Yeah, we shouldn't rush into this. This is big. <laughs> These guys are the lamest robbers ever. Taking a deep breath is good. You guys make a nice couple. I retreat. I repeat, what is happening? 
Are you guys even listening? I know. Let's put the radio on. It'll help us forget about the laundromat. Good idea. No, man. You heard Our Mitch. laundromat Turn the radio on, happened nuts. about an hour ago. Ah, oh, jeez. Witnesses say the two robbers, both dressed like they were into S and M role playing, argued the entire time. Oh my time. God! <laughs> Though the suspects only made off with seventy-two dollars in quarters, they are said to be armed and very dangerous. If you see them, please call the police immediately. We're laughing stocks. And Sonya reporting it no less. Oh jeez. Well, looking like that, I mean. How about we play a game? I guess we could talk about it. I think you guys are great together. Well, I guess that's it. Stan and Mitch are breaking up. Go on and partner up with the kid. Yeah, I guess that's it. Wow. Only one thing left to do. To be sure this is the right move and I'll give the kid Mitch's ultimate bank robin quiz. Yeah. You need to start thinking about your future, kid. <laughs> Here's how it works. Get enough questions, right? You and Mitch become Robin partners. But don't? Then Mitch and I have to... Uh, I don't want to spell it out. Oh, God. Question number one of the following... Look at the trivia what lights. What is the best <laughs> location to rob? The clock is a uh, ticking. Though you can never have too many quarters, this is wrong. Oh. Because sometimes your moto breaks down in front of them. Oh, fuck. I was just trying That's to agree with their one. decisions were. Oh, come on. Question number two. When is the best time to rob? Wrong. What? That's when the Sonya show is on. Oh, what the hell? Strike two. This oh, is your last chance. <laughs> I'm gonna die here. Question three. What is the best getaway vehicle? Helicopter, a motorcycle, a super fast car. Helicopter. Yeah, Gotta be a helicopter. Because from inside it, People look like ants. Stan and I were saving up for one. We were 0.1% of the way there. <laughs> question four. The what? final question. What is the best thing to do with your money at your hideout? Walls? Nope. Because when you change hideouts, you might forget about it. I'm fucked. You lost, kid. Oh my god. <laughs> what the fuck, dude? Oh my goodness. They were so much nicer to us before. That was hilarious. All right, well, we're here and we're fucking starving. We should still, we should still have a decent amount of money. Yep. Road 96. I love how we just play as different characters that arrive here, man. It's pretty neat. <laughs> That's freaking cool. All right, so I I don't know if there was uh 
food over there, but out of stone. Let's go. This is so freaking cool. Should we rest? Zero dollars. No, that's right. They robbed my ass. <laughs> Leave money for others. I got no money, bro. All the money we had, we just got robbed. Unbelievable. I'm going to have to find some food. Oh, goodness gracious. We even walk along the road. Okay. So head to the border. So I wonder if we can actually fail as one of these hitchhikers. Hmm. Oh, well, we're here. We are here. We have arrived. Hide money. I don't have any more money, man. I'm broke. I'm extra super broke. Hi. Snacks and drinks? Can I help you at all? I wanted to cross, but I don't have enough money for a coyote. Maybe I'll just go home soon anyway. We're not going to be able to do much. Some items to help you on your journey. Kid, you've got to show more discretion. There are guards here who'd like nothing more than to arrest us. Special 10-year commemoration of the collapse. There's some never-before-seen footage there. Hmm. Well, I'm going to go back to the camp and see what we can do here. I honestly don't think we, could, we can do much because I don't have money. What's up, dude? I've got no money. I just want to see if there's different characters here. What happened with the tunnel? Did they close it or not? <sighs> maybe I can help with that. The important word being maybe. Uh, I don't have. I don't know if there is a best way. Once a way is discovered, the government adapts. You know what I mean? It's like a hey nuclear man. arms race between Chins and Tyrak. Nah, don't try crossing over the map. Alright, I really need food. Well, look at that. They blocked it, dude. So that's what happens. They block it. Okay, so can I go this way? Well, let me see if there's any food here. Maybe I should give this guy money next time. I, I don't know yet. Kind of low on cash at the moment. Maybe I'll turn back. Hmm. Alright, so we're going to have to turn back. I don't think we have any other choice. So what we're going to do next time we come here, I'm going to make sure that I come with money. We've got to come here with money just to help out these folks. And then we can kind of just go back on our way. I know we also have multiple options. See, if I would have kept my money, $100, I would have been able to help both those people back there. We're going to have to lockpick this shit. Well, what is that? Lockpick it? Force yourself into the truck. Oh, God. Oh, God. Ooh. Oh, my God. No, I'm going to. Uh, no, I can't do that. I've got no stamina left. So that's that's another option that we can kind of. Uh, that we can kind of try next time. Uh, 
<laughs> money talks. That's all I'll say. I don't got money, but fuck. All right, so we're gonna have to see if we can lock pick the first truck. We can squeeze ourselves in there too. Uh, let's just pick the lock in case we still need the stamina later on. Just in case. I should have slept. They recover your stamina. Should have done that. Hide behind the box. Oh my god. Oh good. I pull up to the next checkpoint. Yeah. Good day to you too. That was way too close for comfort. Freedom. <sighs> Nothing is more important, but there are many others in Petra still looking for it. I just want to see what happens with the other characters, man. 79 days later, election day. What's going to happen with this check, dude? And their journeys have only just begun. Hmm. Interesting. <clears throat> All right. So, wow. We've done two different individual hitchhikers, which have thankfully crossed the border, and we've successfully done that. Now, what I find interesting is 
that we have um, the abilities down at the bottom left. And I think every single time that we keep playing with different characters, we unlock more abilities. All right, so I've got no idea what's going to happen now. I don't, I don't know if we're going to choose another character. I would assume we are because there's still characters that stories have to unfold, which we'll find out later. But I don't know in what process or what manner it's going to happen next. So we're going to end it here. I think we've ended it in a pretty sweet spot. This game is pretty cool, man. It is. Um, we'll play it by ear. We'll see how this video does. And if it does well, if it looks like you guys are still interested, we'll continue. And uh, see how all these people's lives end up. But uh, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Catch you later.